guys, this is Sarah with It's Night Paper Co. and I'm coming to you today with my weekly plan with me for July 30th through August 5th. I cannot believe we are in, almost in the eighth month of this year. It is completely crazy. So, I have a kit here from So Cute Planner, which I do actually PR for her, and my code for her is a little different than a lot of my other PR codes, and that code is Sarah15, and that'll save you 15% off on your order. So, go and check her out. She has some really, really good deals. I think think right now she's doing a Christmas in July so go and check that out so I have a lot going on and not really a lot going on actually this week I mean I have some meetings at work and different stuff like that but nothing really and I know last week if you haven't already seen it I did a really fun joint plan with me or plan with us whatever you want to call it with um, Cricut from planner Nina underscore cricket and our husbands also did a joint plan with me as well which was completely and totally just hilarious they are crazy and i'm so glad they got along so well and it just it makes things a lot easier cricket and i met through planning and we have a lot in common and we just kind of we really hit it off so we actually both pr for this shop as well as peekaboo planning too so uh, but we had a lot of fun. She did come to visit. We had I had a vacation last week, and this was my first week back from vacation. And things here lately have just been crazy busy. Right before vacation, we were still on our big push at work, and that is over. But thanks to the push, I guess, or I don't know, I'm not really sure, the caseload. I'm, anyway, they've increased our minimum expected like gold basically for the week so for every week so uh like this past week i didn't work you know the 45 50 plus hours that i had been working which was nice but i did work i want to say like 43 or 4 hours maybe it was only like 42 and a half or something it was more than 40 but less than 50 so I was pleased with the less than 50 part, but anyway, lately life has just been busy. We, uh, I didn't get to do a plan with me the week before the one with me and Cricut because basically Cody and I were working really hard to get our house clean because, well, our house needed to be. Like, I was just ready to get rid of some stuff and just kind of I don't know like I mean I guess it's purge we did a lot of that more or less I'm trying to see what all I have in the kit she gives you a lot of pages I just want to make sure that I don't use something that I want to use for something else so we have to do's we don't have little things or today we have well we have two today's so we're gonna do glitter headers for some of this stuff then okay so let's see here I need to do my habit tracker for my vitamins and I think I'm gonna do another one because we took the dogs to the vet and we have to give one of them some medicine in his eye and his ear we woke up and his um eye was swollen and then when we went of course you know more stuff came up but i mean it, he's fine he's you know doing well he just it was kind of scary though, like seeing his eye all swollen and everything and he could barely open it. it was so sad. But um, they basically just said that they didn't see any kind of like, I think they said like lesion or anything like that in his eye, which was really good. And most likely what happened was he had scratched it or something to that effect more or less because, or gotten something in it but we still wanted to make sure that he was okay so we went ahead and took him to the vet I'm trying to think I'm trying to see if there she's got 
Here we go, actually. Let's do this. Let's do, let's do blue. So we'll be like beginning and ending with the blues. Okay, how big is this and can I fit? Let's just do it that way. And then we'll cover up and just have two. So let's do next week on that one that I'm covering up. There we go. Okay. So now move to date headers. Y'all, this kit is so like summery and pretty. I love it. So anyway, that was one thing, um, cause I'm actually recording this video late on Sunday night. Hopefully if I don't get it up tonight, I'll get it up tomorrow, but hopefully at least anyway. So I got up and helped Cody with some stuff, fell back asleep, decided that if I was going to record, I needed to do my nails. And I know they're not like, you know, professional quality, but I did them myself. So hopefully they're okay and not too distracting. Anyway, so I originally did them and I was like, oh, that is way too, hold on, let me see here. Okay. So 31st and 30th. I didn't like them because they were so long. Like, I like, as you can tell, really short nails. It just, it feels more comfortable for me and it just makes typing easier for me and all that wonderfulness. So I basically keep my nails pretty short. And these are actually a little shorter than I probably, cause we actually went to the vet and then I came home and I was going to come down and record and I was like texting and I could barely text because this thumb was way longer than I liked. So I was like, well, before I go record, I'm going to go fix that. So I went to fix that and then I decided to go ahead and paint my toenails and all that wonderfulness. So I am all done with my little beauty routine, I guess. My nail beauty routine. We'll see. Oh yeah, my sister came by. Uh, they had to meet with some in-laws and they were on their way home, which is about 45 minutes away. And so they decided to stop in for about, I don't know, it's probably 30, 45 minutes and just kind of say hello, which was very nice to see her and the kids. for that amount of time, that short amount of time. I wish it was longer. Hoping that in the next, like, I think two weeks we were talking about having them back up here. So hopefully we can and, you know, it all works out. So, but we shall see. Let me see if this one, yeah, but I think it looks cute layered like that. So let's do yellow over here. Th at least these match, right? Anyway, and then um, and do the Sunday because I didn't know how far up it would go. There we go. So I had a lot of fun last week planning with Cricket and just spending time with her. Like we had such an amazing time and they were so wonderful and took such great care of us the whole weekend. Like, I just, I'm amazed at their generosity. So, anyway, um, just, I don't know. I guess publicly I want to say, thank you, Cricket, you're amazing. I know I'm weird. Not that I'm thankful, but the way I said that. But anyway... So let's see, I'm trying to think what else is going on because I don't think there's really a whole lot going on. At least, I mean, like this week I have two meetings and my mom is going to come this weekend. She's on our cell phone plan and my sister, I think, gave her 
a phone that she used to have, like an iPhone, and so she's switching to that, I think. I'm not really sure what's going on completely, to be honest. I need to figure that out because... Well, actually, no, I was going to say because if she's switching to that, she doesn't have a phone that has data right now, but I forgot that the plan we're on, she has data, she's just not using it. I forgot that. So, because my big thing is, as long as my bill doesn't go up, I'm fine. Anyway. Mostly because we went ahead and the vet we go to has a wellness plan. And basically it covers your vet visits and different things like that. But there's a monthly fee and based on whichever one you decide to do, the prices vary. And we did one that included like teeth cleaning and some extra stuff. And like it included the... Um, like heartworm medicine and flea and tick medicine and all that kind of stuff for the dogs. So it's like an extra $56 a month per dog. But the benefit is we don't have to, like every time we go to the vet, it's like six, seven, eight hundred dollars and I have to like really budget it. So, I mean, I think I did the math and this comes out a little cheaper, but the benefit is instead of it being like me having to like wait until a three paycheck month or, you know, pulling it from savings or something to that effect, then I am paying it monthly and they give you unlimited visits. I mean, you still have to pay for, unless it's like the, annual shots and different things like that you still have to pay for like whatever happens like today with Luce's eye and everything in his ear once we got there we found out he had I think she said yeast in his ear which I've never heard of um and we had an ear problem with him a while back and I mean it's, I hadn't forgotten about it I just I guess it's been so long I hadn't I didn't remember what it was so Anyway, we have to give him these, the, to do this cotton swab rubbing thing in his ear, which he's going to hate us. He doesn't do well with any of that stuff, you know, because you can't explain to him that, you know, it's for his benefit and it's going to help him feel better and all that stuff because he's a dog. But anyway, so Cody gets to have fun with that. That's all I'm going to say because I have no intentions. He just, I mean, and he's not an overly powerful dog, but he just, he manages to get away from me, whereas Cody can kind of usually hold on to him fairly well. So Cody's going to get to do all that funness, and he can hate Cody. I know, I sound horrible. I'm not trying to be, I'm really not. But anyway, so yeah, that is pretty much what's going on there. So we signed up for that, and then I'm wanting to go back and do another home warranty because we had a little scare recently with the um air conditioner and it turned out to be basically nothing at the time with but at the same time like it makes me really nervous because had it been something bigger you know I don't have four thousand dollars for a new AC unit or five thousand or how much ever one costs, two or three thousand even, to replace an AC unit. So if something were to happen, that would not be good. And so I basically want to do that. And so between those three things, my guesstimation is like almost two hundred more dollars a month that I need to find in the budget somehow. It's gonna be interesting. So I'm going to play with that some this week, and I'm actually going to call and see about getting set up for the home warranty as well. We had one when we first moved in, because when you first buy the house, a lot of realtors basically add that to the contract, and ours was awesome, and she did. So we had that, and it's just like, we, we were like, well, we don't really have the money right now, and the house is in fairly good shape, and 
all that kind of stuff. But then you never know. I mean, like, houses are expensive. So, although last night, you know, just to continue on the whole houses are expensive conversation, um, last night, I, well, because of all the cleaning and stuff, I've been in this whole, like, organiz organization mood and trying to get the house kind of where we want it. And so, <clears throat> I decided last night while, you know, binging on YouTube uh, organization videos that I was tired of our kitchen and our bathrooms and if nothing else, I at least want to just get them, like, painted and, you know, make them look a little bit more modern because our house, I don't know if I've mentioned this before, but the house we bought when we bought it that we're living in, we, it was built in... 1985 and the prior owners what little they did do to update they did as cheaply as they could which is hilarious because the house they replaced our house with was about 10 times more than we paid for our house which is maybe not 10 maybe just eight but still a lot more so they had the money uh but anyway so they kind of cheaply did things which is Stuff that we've had to go back and since fix, which has not been the greatest, but anyway, so I just, I don't know, like they never updated the kitchen, they never updated the bathrooms or anything, or, or if they did, they, it's been a while and it was fairly close to what was there before. I'm not really sure, but anyway, so yeah, basically I would like to get it updated and all pretty so I have a work meeting on Monday morning and if you notice I am trying to color block here a little bit and then I have another one on a like team meeting for our team on Wednesday and then on Friday I am probably going to work from home and I think I'm going to use a half box. Well, let's see. Friday is pink. So, yeah, I'm going to use a half box on this one for that. And then, let's see here. I think I'm going to do... The little asterisks for Saturday for my mom coming and dealing with the cell phone stuff. And let's see, I have a chiropractor appointment on Thursday. Those used to always be Monday and now they're always on Thursday because I had to move my physical therapy and I like to keep them exactly a week apart. And these are from Darcy Doodles, and I used up the whole sheet, but I do have a code for her, and that code is, it's a date 25, and that will save you 25% off on your order. And I want to use this cute little mellow right here for work from home, and stick that right there. And let's see, that's my mom cell phone. I don't know, does she have, oh, she does have a cell phone in here, and it's orange. What? There we go. And we'll stick that in there. And let's see. So we have a meeting, a meeting, chiropractor, work from home, mom here, and Cody's work schedule. Where well, did I put that? Okay, so I have all of these stickers. Let's do these. Okay, and these are from Creative Cavern Studio, and I do also have a code for her, and that is it's a date 35. So Cody is going to be working on Monday. And then he'll be off Tuesday, Wednesday, and let's move this up a little. And let's see. Maybe we pull a blue from somewhere else. Yes, okay. So then we have his blue here. And then we'll do another pink on Thursday, Friday. Right there for Cody's schedule. And then here's the 
chiropractor again. All right, so honestly, I think, oh, duh. Okay, so let's do trash day for Thursday. And then we budget and pay bills on, and these are from Stickersis, and I have a code for her, but I do not PR for her. That code is, it's a date. And that will save you twenty percent off on your order. Sorry, I was trying to decide which sticker to use. And then we have her little meadow here, which I'm almost done with one of these sheets, which I bought a ton or got a ton of these sheets. And let's actually, since I wonder how. Okay, so let's do weekend like that. I've never done it that way, but I thought it would be really cute. So, yeah. Um, let's see here. So we have my mom coming. I'm trying to think what else. I think we're pretty much caught up on laundry, so I don't really have anything there. Way in Wednesday. I do need to do that. Okay, so let's do... a yellow right there and one of these scales I'm just gonna stick it on top of it there we go so we have weigh-in Wednesday meetings I mean I know that I'm gonna have laundry that I'm gonna have to do but and I know I'm gonna have to eat gas but Probably Tuesday or Wednesday is my guess. Okay. So I think that is everything that I have right now for this plan with me. Just looking through everything, I think I've got everything. I know my mom is probably going to spend the night this night, but I'm not 100% positive. So anyway, that is my plan with me for this week and like I said not a whole lot going on but some stuff and I got to catch up with y'all a little bit on everything that's been going on in the last few weeks so hope y'all have a wonderful 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 week um and I hope to talk to y'all soon bye guys